Gentlemen. There we have the four bowlers this afternoon, as usual. Sammy Coleman with me and our guest commentator today, one of my real buddies, and what a bowler he is. One of the real greats of bowling, Eddie Jackson. All right, match number one, Diana and Kathy Lightfoot, and the balls will start rolling right after this word about the beer that brings you bowling, and you know what that is. You're so right, that wonderful beauty delight. <laughs> Okay, here we are at Stumps Lanes, and three and four are the lanes. Kathy Lightfoot leads off. She comes a little high, but enough to trip him out of there. And Eddie, that's the way to start. The way to start with, with a big one, Jack. Uh, solid. I'd like to say solid uh, pocket hit, but a little felt funny. Well, we have two newcomers. Here's the other one, Diana Combs. Two Kentuckians. Not quite enough. Didn't quite get it up the hill. I'll say one thing, Eddie. I went down there before the introduction, and Sam, you'll get a kick out of this also. She was sitting there, and she was shaking. I said, are you cold? She says, I think I'm more nervous than I am cold. She says, I am so nervous. I said, now nah, relax. I said, nothing to worry about. She said, well, maybe if I get a couple of strikes, it'll relax. Maybe we'll see. She has three to bring back the two, four, five. Well, she's going to stay nervous, I'm afraid. <laughs> <laughs> uh, she just, I guess we all get that way. We, I've been there, and as soon as that red light goes on, you tighten up a little bit, but she'll loosen up. Diane is uh, quite an intelligent young lady. Uh, she was an honor student over in her high school, valedictorian. Mm -hmm, I should say. Well, Sam, is this the one she's going to bring back with her? That's going to be in the area. Ah, that was a better ball that time. She got up a real nice with that ball. Uh, the next one should be there. She's uh, getting into the hang of the thing. You know, this is the first time, Sam, we've been here, and Eddie, many times. First time we've been on lanes three and four, isn't it? That's right. Last show we did was on five and six when Jack Calhoun was here. That's a shame. Yeah, that's not the way to get out of the gate. Uh, no, that puts you really behind, and you have your opponent here starting with a strike, and if she doubles, she can start really putting the pressure on Diana. And she's going to be there. Hey, this, uh, this young lady looks like she's quite a bowler. I uh, was watching her out there, and her ball seems to roll real heavy. It's got that heavy roll to it, and uh, it hits hard. Sam, you know, when we mentioned last week she was going to be on, this is the girl from that family of, an athletic family in Dayton, uh, the Lightfoot family. Yeah, I understand that. All but one, that 07. That's a, a good hit in this house, Jack. Uh, they get tremendous sideboard action down there, and, off, and they just fly around here. You bowl here on Thursday night, do you not, Eddie? Oh, I'm bowling. Now, go ahead and tell us what you're averaging. <laughs> well, I'm averaging sort of a little 212 with Mario over there with 29. Listen to this, Sam. 212? Yeah. 212. That's only... <laughs> averaging 212, my goodness. Well, we got Mario and Bob Harvey and Buck Gray. We are the over-the-hill gang. <laughs> Nothing over the hill about those averages. Well, let's see if we get Diana on the board. Now, get over there. Uh -huh. My golly. At least Eddie was talking about the over the hill. Over hill get tournaments on at Seymour's right now. High is 640, so we might be able to beat that with handicap. Handicap? <laughs> yeah, handicap. Yeah, yeah. 50, 60, 70. According to what division you're in. You're in 50 and 60, ain't you? You betcha. <laughs> Come on. I'm a little higher, Ned. Don't blow the spare now. Oh, right. uh, She's on the board now. Uh, this this young lady right now, I was, I was talking to her. Uh, 
She's got a 3.91 average over at the Northern Kentucky U right now. And I said, what happened? She says, I got to be. <laughs> She's going to be a microbiologist. Maybe this will relax her now. She got that spare. Got on the board. Now let her let her run up there. She's not just missing. About about a half a board off, Eddie. Yeah, she's going to have to make an adjustment to the right jack. Uh, historically, uh, this house usually plays outside, and then as the lanes break down, and you make the adjustment to the left. And I think uh, Diane has to just go with what they're giving them, which is the outside shot. This is one of the toughest spares I've ever had to bring back, that sleeper. The two and the eight right in back of it. You had to hit that two hard like that. And that's a toughie to bring back. Right, Sam? Right. She's throwing the ball a lot better now. She's a little more loose, relaxed. Look at the smile on her. Look at her. Here's Kathy Lightfoot, 24 years of age. And she is throwing a lot of ball down there today. That was a freight train there, and uh, speaking of freight trains, uh, you know Lolly's back at it again. I heard he's averaging 199, the big train, Art Lally. Oh, that's great news. You know, I'm anxious for King to get started to see some of the old timers. Pardon Eddie, like Eddie Jackson and Sam Coleman and Art and Motts to get back on the program again. Well, we're going to start uh, January the 9th over at Western Bowl. The first show will be on the 17th. Well, we got the over Western Bowl. They got the Junior Tra BPA Traveling League there today. I tell you, Sam, he's he's a Eddie. This guy's just got all knowledge. He, he knows where everybody's going to be. Oh, I, I know. And uh, when you speak of Western, I was over there the other night watching Calhoun Bowl. And, uh, speaking of throwing a ball, uh, he's hotter than. Firecracker right now. How about hotter than stove, any? Mm. 780, 770. Well, Diane Combs would like to have a couple of those right now. Big strikes. She's looking for her first one, and she's not going to get it that way. She's still got to make that move uh, to the right and uh, get the ball pointed up a little bit. Yeah, she's kind of side with a little bit, Ed. Mm -hmm. Strange enough, they all throw the ball, the track's about the same place on the ball. She has the old bucket set up down there. And she leaves two. I'd say she needs help. Yeah, she's 50, 50 behind in the fifth already. That's not too good. That's just too bad. She's uh, only 19 years old, and she started bowling over Walt Center Lanes in the sixth grade, and old Dottie Wagner was her coach all those years. She, you know, she can't buy one. I don't care what she does. She had a beautiful hit back there in the third frame, didn't carry. That could have maybe kicked that seven out of there, but... Uh, they're making Diana go all the way. Mm -hmm. Two shots per frame. Right on it. Right smack on target. She's shooting her spares a little different. I know she's playing everything off the center. Mm -hmm. It's a shame, Eddie. You can't go down there during the match and correct it. Mm -hmm. Correct our problem. That girl don't need no correction. <laughs> I tell you, that Kathy's bombing them right in there, isn't she? I would say uh, she gets up there and just strokes the ball right toward the hole and uh, lets it roll, and that's the name of the game. And there she's bombing them. You're talking about bombing them. Rick Hensley shoot an 846 at Super Bowl Wednesday night. Yeah, 299 game. That's our defending king of TV bowling. A little pull on that one, and she got by with it. She'll take them on either side. When you're loose, they go. <laughs> Isn't that the truth? I used to have a feeling that the pins knew exactly if that ball was rolling free or you were trying to fit it. I think that Sam, you'll agree to that, won't you? That's right. Oh, boy, up jumped the devil here for Diana. 
as our old buddy Peck Haver Camp would say, you know, we got a free ball coming. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he's talking about Peck uh, and brings back memories of Nagelson, you know. He's not uh, doing so well. He's in the hospital. Hamill Nagelson's over at what? At St. George, isn't he? St. George, right. right. Speedy recovery to Amel. Slide it, slide it. Sam, I could say we could almost close the book out on Diana. Yeah, I think the race is over. Now, I shouldn't say this, because Eddie's going to get a bang out of this. But as asking Kathy Lightfoot, I said, I happened to mention about the Lightfoot family, knowing it from years ago, from my days in Kentucky. I'll continue it in a moment. Oh, now look what we have there. And I said, I remember playing football against a Charlie Lightfoot, one of the rugged individuals. And she says, oh, yes, Jack. She says, that, that was my grandfather. Yeah. <laughs> now, don't say anything, Sam. He got these kicks out of it. <laughs> he was a boxer also, Charlie Lightfoot. Real good athlete. That whole Lightfoot family. She's just had a world of problems out here, and it's just too bad. Diana right now says, my goodness, where it was that 10th frame to get this over. Yeah. Drove from Kentucky to do this, and she's probably saying, I probably missed the bridge on the way back. I tell you, Kathy's here got a pretty fair game going for her first appearance on television. Yeah, she's thought it super. Mm -hmm. She's going to have a toughie coming up in our top qualifier in match two, Vi McKinney. 700 what she shot right here. You know, she's going cross lanes at him, and that's the preferred way. And she's on it. She, I tell you, this girl, uh, she knows what she's doing out there. She's been there. Uh, she's got good good alignment with her shoulders and her feet and everything else. Uh, she's, she's pretty accurate right where she's lined up to where she wants to go. What I like, it, particularly this year, Eddie, we're seeing so many new faces among the girls. Yeah, this is true. I think uh, Pam's the first uh, one that's uh, ever repeated, isn't it? Right, first repeater we ever had as queen. That's right. She's got almost a, she's got a seven, uh, 200 series in her back pocket right. here, hasn't she? She has. Game. Oh, yeah. well, we got a new one on next week. Regina Pollard, that's Bill Pollard's daughter. And she throws the ball nice, uh, Sam. Yeah, I watched her bowl out at uh, Mount Healthy. And I watched her over at uh, Waltz. And... Uh, of course, Bill's just about quit now. He's got Ricky, <laughs> Ronnie, and, and Diana. Or Regina. Regina, yeah. Regina She's going to yeah. make a long trip from Versailles, isn't she? Yeah. That's true. That's where we'll be next Sunday at Glenmore. Then we got the finals at LaRue on the 19th at 1.30. We'll have 14 bowlers in the finals. All right, Diane, come on. All right. She still won't make that move to the right, and she keeps wanting to send the ball, and I guess uh, just getting up there ahead of it and can't get it through. It's a shame you can't translate your thoughts down to and just say, now, Diane, move just slightly. Mm-hmm. See what she does this time. She's going to be close. And I know she pulled it. A little high. Pulled it to the right. Mm-hmm. Well, Diane is going to say, thank goodness this one's over. She has fought him from the opening bell, and she went all the way through it without an X. That's hard to believe, Sam, but sure it is. happens, doesn't it? Well, Jerusha did the same thing over to Waltz. Yeah, she had the same problems. All right. One, two, one. Two, one. There's nobody feels any worse than Diane right now. Here's Kathy Lightfoot flirting with a 200 series. Oh, ripper. Okay, she rolls a lot of ball. 
You know, one thing about Diane, though, she can always say, well, at least I made the show. Mm-hmm. And I'll go into the final elimination. That's right. And she Who knows you can turn things completely around and be, well, maybe be, make the program. That's you never right. know. How many games will they roll? Five games. Five games. That'll be an equalizer. I tell you, I like the way this girl rolls the ball. Keeps it in the area. Mm -hmm. uh, she's checking the sheet. I think she's concerned. <laughs> two, two, six. Am I right, sir? Right. Talking about light foot. That's what she's on her feet. Light foot. Throws the ball good. She really does. Smooth delivery, solid at the line. Gets that ball in the area, right on target, and she's got a two, two, six. The winner in match one is Kathy Lightfoot over Diana Combs. Match two, right after this. Ah. 